فرهاد هر ایرانی آزادی آزادی فرهاد هر ایرانی آزادی آزادی فرهاد هر ایرانی آزادی آزادی ما زن و مرد جنگی بجنگ تا بجنگی ما زن و مرد جنگی بجنگ تا بجنگی Good evening. Good evening. We have a very important occasion here. It is. It's very important. We are mm. here, we gathered here tonight uh, to, in remembrance of uh, Neda Agajan and mm. all others that were killed by Iranian regime in the last 12 days in Iran. Uh, their uh, request was simple. They were, uh, they were asking uh, a new referendum. Uh, they were killed for freedom and democracy. And this vigil is in their honor and their remembrance of uh, what the Iranian people have been, have paid the price in past 12, 13 days and forwarded a war to realize that what is going on in Iran. And also, in a silent way, ask Mr. Obama to do more than being shaking. We are asking him not to recognize Ahmadinejad as the president of mm -hmm. Iran. He is not the president of Iran. Mm -hmm. And to ask uh, Mr. Obama to, to push for uh, having an embargo in Iran, to close all the ties with, you know, with Iranian regime, do not negotiate with them. Uh, what would be the principle if uh, Mr. Obama negotiate with this regime after things settle, after all this bloodshed mm -hmm. and all these young people, innocent lives that has been um, gone from, with, you know, from us, uh, and why should we sit and still talk to Iranian mm -hmm. regime? But there is a, a leverage aspect, and it has something to do with the nuclear buildup. Uh, the power plants and then exactly. potentially the so weapons. So now you see that with the simple mm -hmm. request that the people had, their mm -hmm. request was simple, recount or having a new referendum under mm -hmm. UN supervision. It was clapped, clamped down. It was uh, brutally, brutally uh, oppressed by the Iranian regime. Mm -hmm. Now imagine if they have the nuclear weapon, what would be they, they do? You can see the extent of what will happen if they have the means and the power. Mm -hmm. And uh, but if all the West recognize Iranian people will, mm -hmm. which they have shown in past 12 days, and show their solidarity mm -hmm. by not recognizing Ahmadinejad, mm -hmm. prosecuting. Khomeini and Ahmadinejad, you know, issue a, a, an arrest uh, against them. So this way, the cutting all the ties, it allows the Iranian regime to, it will help the Iranian regime would fall and a real change happens. Mm -hmm. And that's what these people do really ask. Mm -hmm. Nedo died innocently mm -hmm. in front of all mm -hmm. our eyes. Mm -hmm. It was a very simple thing that happened, and but just for one thing, for freedom and democracy. Okay. Well, is it possible that Mr. Rafsanjani will bring an answer? I mean, is is he an ally in in reference to this perspective on the West versus the current I think, president? I think at this time people have spoken. If you listen to the, the slogans that they are mm -hmm. saying. They say that we don't want anyone to decide for us what mm. to do. No one know? person? Well, now they, they want, they mm -hmm. were asking for Musavi, mm -hmm. but now they are saying, you know, we just want a referendum. Let us, what they say, death to dictator, mm -hmm. it means that they don't want dictatorship. Now, what role can anyone play? Anyone who can distance themselves from this regime mm -hmm. is welcome. Okay. Who do you think should be leading Iran right now? I leave that to Iranian people when there is a free mm -hmm. uh, democracy, society in Iran, and people can uh, 
uh, really we have we just but let me tell you we had only four candidates mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. now if there is a free democracy and we have hundred candidates let's let people to decide okay. to see to who they want them to are be. you saying suggesting that the model should be more like what we have here in the states Definitely. which is not perfect by any means but but, but it's still mm -hmm. it's a model mm -hmm. it's still people that you have you start with 20, 30 candidates, mm -hmm. and then you go down mm -hmm. to two candidates at the very last year, right? Mm -hmm. Sure. So have similar, something similar to that. You can say Guardian Council, old mullahs, to make a decision that there are just four, two people that, four people that you can vote mm -hmm. out of the what 500 people that they, mm -hmm. you know they announce their candidates. Mm -hmm. Sure. So your options is very limited, but if you widen that. And let people to uh, campaign to show their agenda and what they do. People make their own decision. Okay. That's why we are asking for a new referendum under UN supervision. Okay. And how many folks do you think? I mean, there's a lot of people out here tonight, and it seems as though this is a very strong message being sent. And we. Do you feel it's going to be effective? Uh, all of us have to do something. Mm -hmm. All of us. Even standing here in silence is a it's mm -hmm. a statement that we are making. And it's great that you and have the right to do that, right? And exactly. Mm -hmm. It's great that we have the opportunity. Mm -hmm. But imagine that our people even couldn't stand mm -hmm. just silently in Iran and, mm -hmm. and practice that. That's the level of the basic rights that mm -hmm. Iranian people do not have mm -hmm. in Iran. Okay. And how long have you been here? I lived in here for 24 years. 24 years? Yes, I left Iran. To, I was a political prisoner mm -hmm. myself in Iran, and I have lost a lot of my family members. Mm -hmm. And then I escaped Iran and I came to the United States. And it, this here became my, my home. Okay. And is there a way that people can get in touch with your group to show support? Online? Uh, sure. Uh, online, uh, we have an Iranian American, uh, Iranian American uh, of Northern Virginia. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I don't have the website right now. Okay, but you can it. Google that you, you of can Northern Google Virginia. It, yes, Northern Virginia. Iranian American. Yes. Is then there they a they press can. contact or any particular? Uh, press person? contact is my name, Shirin Nariman, and okay. my number is 703-856-2565. And I'd be happy okay. to help. And you know, we we are building more uh, uh, dynamic uh, websites right mm -hmm. now, and we can you know. Uh, share it with everyone to join us and to help us out okay. even by standing here silently okay well I want to make sure that this gets out to the community and uh, people that are interested across the country across the world that want to support you and at least want to express some concern about this important set of interests uh, that have been occurring right and as it continues to grow and, Which it and, will. and that is great. So everyone can help. Everyone mm -hmm. can write to Mr. Obama. Everyone mm -hmm. can write to their uh, senator, to their mm -hmm. representative, and say, Defend, stand by Iranian people. Do not have any negotiation with Iranian regime. This is what they did to the innocent lives, okay. innocent people, and everybody can help. Okay, but they can also call you, and they can, and call they can participate, exactly. regardless of whether they live in the States or yes. beyond, yes. and exactly. you'll be interested in speaking with them. Exactly. Thank you I'd so much for speaking with Thank me, you. and uh, hopefully this will be a very productive evening, and you'll be able to accomplish what you're looking to Thank do. Thank you, and in again, in honor and remembrance of Neda Agha Hassan and all those others who were killed brutally under this regime in past 12 days. It's so good to meet you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.